It's not that we just want to go write a bunch of tickets for people. We just want them to stop running a daggum school bus stop signs. But drivers don't seem to be getting the message in Blunt County. I get at least one to two calls a week of people complaining about somebody running a school bus stop sign. This week, a mom was waiting for her daughter to get off the bus at Highway 160 near Hayden. The bus puts on its lights and extends its arm for kids but a car still speeds by. Yeah, I don't understand how anybody could think it's okay to do that. Um, I don't care if you do believe the kids are gonna get off the bus and go to the right. That does not give you the right to run the stop sign on the left. Sheriff Mark Moon has sat and watched for speeders himself, but he says he doesn't have the resources for a deputy to follow every bus in the county. The sheriff says it's not about the ticket or how much it might cost, but about correcting bad behavior that could be deadly. I'm not talking about a ticket. I'm not talking about jail. I'm talking about you running that stop sign and a kid stepping out from behind that bus and you hitting that child. A plea from parents and law enforcement. Kids' life is way more important than five minutes late to work. To think before you get behind the wheel. In Blunt County, Mary O'Connell, WVTM 13.